there are a bunch of new things in this Sonic Speed Simulator update, some small things and some big things. So today I'll be showing you everything new in this Sonic Speed Simulator update. Please be sure to like and subscribe as I do really appreciate it and I hope you enjoy the video. When you first spawn in you may notice there is the third wave of golden eggs. Here you can find two new skins, Gold Style Jet and Android Shadow Gold. And you may have found something interesting as well. Gold Style Knuckles is back. However, this time he has an exotic rarity. If this wasn't odd enough, if you currently own the limited Gold Style Knuckles, you'll see you'll, you still have a limited Gold Style Knuckles. This is because they want to keep it fair that everyone has a chance to get every skin in the game. The thing that's unique about the limited Gold Style Knuckles is if you open up your character menu, you'll see that only 300 people own him with this rarity. If you missed out on the previous battle, of the bands event don't worry it's still here you can still unlock dj knuckles and rockstar silver they both even have the event set making these skins worth picking up something you may not have noticed is that some of the newer knuckle skins can actually now glide players have been asking for this or just character abilities in general and a lot of people including me are very happy with this something else you probably didn't notice is that the adventure knuckles skin got secret Secretly updated this update. It now has a more cartoonish design like Adventure Shadow does, and even the Mega Sale shows the original Adventure Knuckles, so you can see a side by side comparison. These skins look completely different to be honest, and even the eyes are different, you can just tell so much. Another cool thing they added is achievements. If you look in the top right of your screen, you'll see a new trophy icon, and if you click on it, you'll see all these achievements. If you get to 90% in your total badge progression, you will see a big claim button letting you claim the new Elite Sonic skin. This is one of my favorite skins and it's definitely worth unlocking. I mean, at star 6 his stats are insane, and he even has the event stat. And if you look at the crown you'll notice it's very high detailed, and if you look at Birthday King Sonic's crown, you'll notice a big difference. I mean, Birthday King Sonic's crown just looks like a craft compared to Elite Sonic's crown, I'm not gonna lie. A strange thing that you'll notice is that at this grind rail right here, you'll actually notice that there's now a dash pad for some reason. This was just added in this update, and to be honest, I don't know why. And sometimes it doesn't even get you on the rail. Something that also got updated is the Chow sale. Now you can find a yellow Shadow Oma Chow, a yellow Hoodie Chow, a Jet Chow, and finally a gold metal Sonic Oma Chow. If you didn't know the yellow Hoodie Chow was also rare, but now the value of it just came crashing into the ground. Something else they completely updated is the way the gold egg works. Now you will have to get 25,000 steps and you will get one gold egg. However, you can do this as many times as you want to. And if you get 50 gold eggs, you can actually get three bonus premium eggs for free, which I think is pretty cool. You can also now find a completely new character in the game. You can find Marine by the fast travel portal, and she actually says to find her on higher ground. What this means is that you have to go to Hilltop, and you will find her event there. And I'm not gonna lie, there are some pretty tough tasks that you have to do to unlock her. Collecting 10,000 Chow Fruit is quite a lot. For OG players, you're probably gonna like this one. If you're in Lost Valley and you go all the way over here, you'll actually see a blue gate that allows you to buy your way into this little obby thing. And in this obby, you will actually see a portal to Lost Valley Classic. This portal literally teleports you to the OG Lost Valley, and there's even an enchantment table teasing us once again. They left this place pretty much untouched, other than these Eggman boxes and balloons being everywhere. There's even the World 3 portal 
but there's actually no portal inside of it. And you might even find one of these blue boxes around the map. We don't really know what those are, but they're just some random part that doesn't do anything. There's also the spring that doesn't work at all, and for some reason, it even has a purple beam in it. And there's also the old ring vaults here. OGs will remember these things. You used to come back like every 12 hours and you could get some more rings. And then my favorite secret here is the Tails card. That actually doesn't do anything, but this is just like the old thing. You would collect it and then unlock Tails just like that. This was here in the last update, but you may have also noticed that there is now auto run in Emerald Hill. This auto run works very well, and it's just like auto run in Green Hill and Lost Valley. I hope to see a uh, auto run in Hilltop because I feel like that would be pretty overpowered. Something you might have been confused about is how they literally deleted the settings tab. Well, if you look in the top left, you can actually see that the settings tab is right there and they just changed its spot. You can also find a help tab in case you forget anything or for new players. You also may remember the moonstones. These things let you change the time to night and it makes the game look really cool. In this update, they just put a moonstone right near the spawn so that you can change it to night whenever you want. And if you remember where the old one is, it is still there. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and if you did, please be sure to like and subscribe as I do really appreciate it. I also recently set up memberships for my channel, so if you want to go check out my memberships, you can. Anyway, yeah, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.